Longview City Council resumed discussion tonight about the budget for the 2024-2025 fiscal year after tabling it last week. KLTV's Alex Weister has more on what happened inside the meeting. Longview City Council met to discuss the fees and charges along with the budget for the upcoming fiscal year. Last week, discussion was tabled after council felt they were not ready to vote. During public comment, residents expressed unhappiness with the proposed cuts to the mentoring budget. I respect the responsibility you have in this community. However, I urge you to take the time to fully understand the role of each position before considering these cuts. These are not just jobs. They are vital to the successful programs that serve our risk at risk youth. After public comment, Mayor Ishihara showed the amendments to the budget that council discussed since last meeting. The new amendments include restoring street maintenance funds and removing all fee changes and one-time purchases. There are cuts that need to come out of the budget. Obviously, less fees, which would provide revenue to the city, means that we have to talk about taking some things out of the budget that was originally proposed. District 5 Council Member Michelle Gamboa motioned to remove the decrease in the mentoring budget, second by District 4 Member John Newstad. A 6-1 to vote was in favor of the motion and the proposed budget, keeping all proposed changes the same otherwise. This vote was something that local mentor Amanda Ross was happy with. It was a really good feeling to have everybody come out and speak about how important Aspire is and what it's done in their lives as mentors and mentees. Um, I'm really thankful that we changed our council's mind tonight. Alex Weister, KLTV 7 News. An increase to water and sewer was also proposed in that budget, which was approved, increasing water and wastewater rates that will be raised by 3.4%.